Uh, I've always believed that elections should never rely on luck. And I think in some ways that's been the Republicans' failure the last two elections, right? The Democrats have been counting ballots. We've been counting voters. Uh, that's the term I hear regularly among Republicans. That's something a lot of Republicans say to me. So Republicans want to count ballots this time. They're going to get in the early voting game in a big way. And remember, without doing that, Republicans just barely lost the last two elections. So getting in and adding two, three, four hundred thousand votes per state before Election Day is going to have a profound effect. I'm going to make some other bold predictions. I think there's a strong possibility that Joe Manchin comes in and runs as an independent and strips votes away from mm -hmm. Joe Biden. That's something that I think is behind the scenes giving Joe Biden some pause. And I think there's going to be another effort to get on all of the battleground states constitutional amendments to enshrine parents' rights in the state constitutions, go beyond what the legislatures have done. That will drive up conservative votes. Those three things probably change the trajectory of Republican voting in 2024 and, mm -hmm. and I think are going to scare uh, Democrats. And keep in mind, the map for the Senate is a lot less favorable this time for Democrats. So it's going to be a tough election in 2024 for uh, Democrats, regardless of what happens to Joe Biden.